Welcome to another DMG tutorial. I'm your host Jonathan Parkinson and in this open shot tutorial we're going to be looking at transition. Go ahead and bring in the files that you're going to be working with into this box. For this I'm going to be using a video as well as an image. So I'm going to take this video and I'm going to break it up so I can add this image in between as a transition. I'm going to take the chop tool and I'm just going to chop it up. I'm going to go ahead and add a, another track below. So first things first is I'm going to bring this bar directly there. I'm going to take that image. I'm going to stick it there. I'm going to shorten it up a bit. Alright, so for this first segment, I'm going to go to Properties by right clicking, going over to Video, and I'm going to go to Fade Out, click Apply. For this segment down on the second line, I'm going to go to Properties, Video, Fade In, and Fade Out, Apply. I then come up here and click on this Transition tab. I will pick the transition I want to work with. For this example, I will use the hourglass. All right. I also do not want this transition to take so long, so I'm going to right click it, go to properties, and I'm going to bump this down to about 3. Click apply. Make sure you're on the arrow tool. And I want, there you go, and I want my arrow to be pointing down. If it's not pointed down, just right click it and click switch direction. Alright, so since I have this right here, it's going to be overlapping. So I'm going to go ahead and move this and this down. I'm going to stick another segment of this first portion down here. And then right click and duplicate the first transition and move it right there. Again I want the arrow to be pointed down. So now when I press play okay, don't forget to fade in. So I need to go back and fade in, apply Alright, and there you go. And that's basically what you need to do, so you can just play around and see how that works. So you need to make sure you stick each new clip on a new line. If you try to stick them together, you will see... This is how it looks. So it'll double up. And that's it. If you, again, if you have any questions about transitions, you can go ahead and leave them in the comments below. And thanks for watching.